A hybrid course is a course where some of the instructional time is in a traditional face-to-face -face, uh, format and uh, the rest is done online. Uh, depending on the class, that percentage can vary. Those online experiences are really replacing our traditional face-to-face -face class time. And there's a lot of thought that goes into that to make sure that uh, we're not just asking somebody to read a book and take a quiz, but instead we're trying to design some experiences. I'm taking an online class for Global Leadership, and it's a three-credit course. How the course works is you get um, the assignments are given to you every Thursday and you have 10 days to, uh, to complete them until the following Sunday and you uh, submit everything on Blackboard. At Cabrini you'll start to see more hybrid classes. Um, in most courses at, at Cabrini we see a lot of interaction between students and faculty uh, and it's really important to us as faculty that we maintain that and yet we know that students want and need more flexibility. I wasn't expecting the course to be as hard as it um, is. I, I just have a lot of uh, essays, short essays to write, and they kind of add up to like 10 pages a week compared to my average course. I don't have an essay due every time I attend class. Some draft definitions of what blended versus hybrid versus online mean so that you as students, when you go and look at a course listing and you say, oh, that's a hybrid class, it's important that you as students know what that means. Um, I think it's pretty simple the way they have it set up. Um, you're talking to your instructor, uh, your instructor and classmates the whole time, so I think it's fine the way they set it up. A new technology called Jing to use their webcam and go through and do the presentation that way. And then upload it to Blackboard. Students can look at each other's presentations. And it was really kind of fun for me because the student presentations, I believe, were better quality when they were done in front of the webcam than they were when they were done in front of the class. Um, if you don't have to take an online course, if there's another option, if you could just take a regular um, course, and I would go with the in classroom setting. I think um, it's a lot easier than taking an online course and having the workload that comes along with it. As students, I'd encourage you to be aware, to look at uh, the, the different formats, to learn a little bit more about them, and to try some of them.